Hi, Gemini. This is Genevieve with Belly Down and Moonbeams. How are y'all doing? I'm doing quite well. This is a week for March, reading for March 8th through 14th, 2021. And yes, I've been gone all week. I, I'm actually going through some things on my own and I needed a break. And I think that's really valid. And one of the things I got out of this is that every day is new. Every moment is new. And yes, you're going, yeah, mm -hmm, we know that. Well, you, the thing is, Gemini, what that means is that we can reinvent ourselves each and every moment. That means that if you haven't done yoga for two and a half years, like I haven't, you can still get up and do it tomorrow. Because it's a new day. Or... If you haven't been going to bed on time, you can start tonight. Whatever it is you need to do to make your life look like what you want it to look like, you can start right now. You don't have to have stay stagnant. You don't have to just sit there and deal with stuff you don't want to deal with anymore. That means you don't like your best friend, get rid of her. If you don't like your 20 pounds that you gained during COVID, start washing when you eat now. Not yesterday. You can't change yesterday. And it's okay to move forward. That's a good thing. So the first thing I get for y'all is the seven of uh, cups. And we're going to turn this over. And this card is all about being castles in the air and looking at things from a different perspective. But it's also about making good decisions because he, he's got all these cups at his fingertips. And he's going, which one? Which one? But some of them kind of suck, like that snake. And other ones, like these flowers, are pretty cool. But his cat, his head's up in the clouds and he's not sure which one. So, kind of like the Price is Right thing, you know, back in the day. The price is right, and you would, do they still do that? But anyway, because you have to know which way to pick, and you have to make a good decision. Right now, you've got this reversed. That's the Eight of Swords. You are feeling trapped and caught up. You don't feel like you have any control. You feel like you've got all these swords around you, and see, he's got water at his, she's got water at her feet, and she's blindfolded and bound up. And you're feeling overwhelmed. And I think a lot of us have been feeling overwhelmed. But go ahead and allow that to happen. And see, the person, if you look, there's water at that person's feet. So she can't even move forward because she'll get wet. And because she's bound up, she doesn't know where to go. Because on either side of her, it's all the swords. On the flip side, you get this card, which is a five of swords, which says that you're going to win. See, he's got all the swords and everybody's running away. So you need to get your head out of the clouds and quit feeling overwhelmed because you're going to win. You're also going to finish a project. This is the Ace of Swords. Whatever you've been working on is going to come to a head and it's going to work out fine. You're going to have success at that. But then after that, there's some change. Some serious change are coming. Yeah, I feel that for so many of us. So there's change that's coming. Okay, now I'm going to pull a card from the Earth Magic Oracle deck. I just got opened this deck a week or so ago, and I love it. And this says, Green Man, Synergy. Synergy is like serendipity, sort of, where things all come together and work out. So, and it's just kind of magical pulling together. It, it might be running into an old friend that, that you've been thinking about. But you're going to have the energy to deal with things. You're going to, it's all going to come together for you. But you're going to have to go through all of these other things to get there. Head out of the clouds, going through the battle, 
getting out of that overwhelmed and coming into that success. But that's not always easy. I'm going to pull one more card for y'all. And this card is focus, crystal focus. So that means that as you pull your head out of the clouds, you need to focus, get that tunnel vision and go what, do what you need to do. And I think you already know what that is. And if you don't, maybe you need to ask spirit. Okay, on Thursday, Mar March 11th at 7 p.m. Central Standard Time on Facebook, on, Me on Belladonna Moonbeam's Facebook page, I'm going to be doing a Facebook Live. Send me some pendulum questions. Send me some tarot questions. Call me, however you want to do it. Also, if you want to do a private reading, send me a text to 405-512-9400. And of course, subscribe to my channel so you'll never miss another reading again.